Dr. Poles got a hunch why Storm can't keep anything down, and it's no laughing matter. What kind of grain do you feed? Come on this side, out of the wind. It's just a mix. No beet pulp, no, no. pellets. Uh, there's beet pulp in it. Dried beet pulp, uh-uh, because that beet pulp is so hygroscopic, meaning it attracts water so fast that it just <laughs> expands in his esophagus, and then he get plugged. Storm's condition is aptly called choke. Although he can breathe, food is lodged in his throat, making it impossible for him to eat or drink. I'll get some warm water. I'm going to put a tube up his nose, and we'll blow it through. Choke is always an emergency situation. Uh, it's something that you cannot put off till the next day. You do it, and you do it now. Without treatment, Storm's at risk of dehydration and a deadly form of pneumonia. Now, have you ever seen a horse being tubed up the nose? Nope. Well, here we go. <laughs> what I'm trying to do is you know, up the nose, and then he swallows it, and then I'll try to blow the obstruction either down or up. So yes, both of us will get dirty. OK. It sounds simple. Yep. It's not. In a horse, when you push the tube up the nose, they have to swallow. Otherwise, you go into the windpipe, into the trachea. Hey! And that's the way he normally behaves. He's usually Fight. feisty. Dr. Pohl finds the blockage by inhaling and exhaling through the tube. But occasionally, this technique backfires. <laughs> Man. And everything. Sometimes you get a mouthful of crud, but <coughs> <coughs> at least it doesn't kill you. I can hear it. it don't sound too good. It's gonna be a job. I felt what the plug was. Okay, watch out. With a big syringe, you push the water through. The plug hopefully will either wash out up or down. Holy Moses. And push down. Keep pushing hard. I know, bud. Yeah, yeah. We're gaining, we're gaining. Keep pushing, just push it in. We're done, because look at this. It's running in, see that? Mm -hmm. And nothing's coming back. <laughs> that was easier than I thought. 